gate that you will come in to come into school. It's easy to remember because it's green. It's a bit noisy sometimes. We go right across the playground and we can take this as fast or as slow as you need it to be. You'll know our building because we have our two red doors and we're beside a lovely picture of a river. We need to wait at the doors for a grown-up to use their pass to unlock the door. But then, come on inside. Now that we're inside, we can go three different ways. We can go this way to all the classrooms and we can go this way to soft play, sensory and one classroom or we can go straight ahead to the garden. Come and I'll show you the garden. There's lots of fun things out here. This is a frame that you can move bits around and see if you can get them in the right place. Yay! I've matched the two cats. But this is my favourite bit. The drums. They can be noisy. Over here, we have our shoot, sorry, our shoot, our swing, and our tire swing. And in the hut, we have lots of bikes and scooters and other toys for you to play with. And at this side of the garden, we've got the mirrored balls that you can see your reflection in. You'll sometimes go very fat or sometimes go very slim, depending on where you go. And then we've got lots of bricks that you can see one of our friends has made a tower with. So come and we'll go back into that corridor and I'll show you where we can go next. And let's go this way. And the first room that we come to is for soft play. The boys and girls like being in here. They like to bounce on the trampolines that are under here or hide in the little cave. But some children like to balance on the bits, the beam and going up and down the bits. Okay, that was soft play. Come and see sensory. When you come in, we'll put the lights on. And once you put your shoes into the box, you can come and find something to play with and then choose what you're going to relax with. Now, hopefully, it'll work. You'll see how colourful this room is when the lights are off. And now we'll go across the hall to the classroom. This classroom it's called the yellow room and you will know the classroom that you are in. At the moment, these are the children in the classroom and they hang their coats up at the pegs and then put their bags and lunch boxes underneath their coats. There's a sink to wash your hands. And that will be, washing your hands will be the first thing that you do when you come to school. And then you'll be able to choose some toys to play with. And then you'll be asked to come to the table where we will say hello and do some singing. Some people work at little workstations on their own. One here. And some people work at the big table. Other people 
work in the quiet room where they can have, make as much noise as they want and play with all the toys because it won't disturb anyone else in the room. So that was the yellow room, that was one of the classrooms and all the classrooms are very similar. This says wait and we can't go out this door without a grown-up but come along and see what's out here. Here are the photos of all the boys and girls that are currently in the cove. All the children with yellow flowers are in the yellow room and the blue flowers are children from the blue room. This though is a lovely cosy radiator that in the winter we can dry things on. So we walk past this radiator, past the toilets for the mainstream children, and then another cosy radiator before we come to the green button. So we press the green button to open the door and we hold the door for our friends to come through and then make sure oh, it shuts afterwards. So on the blue floor here, this is where we come to another place to stop. There are lots of places to go from the blue floor. We can go to see the janitor and tell the janitor that something's broken or needs fixed. We can go to the library and choose some books. I'll quickly show you what's in here. So there are lots of great stories in here to read. And you can research things. From the library, we can then go out into the courtyard so out this door is the courtyard for the whole school and when you come there will be lots of apples and pears growing on these trees. That was the outside space and if we just keep going along from the blue matting we'll come to the office and one of your favourite ladies will be in here. This is where Mrs. Braden works. <laughs> Good morning. From the office, we can keep going down this corridor, and the first door leads us into the hall. This is a really big space, and we don't come here very often because it is so big. But there's a nice little place, and through this blue door is the gym. And as you can see, it's all set up for an obstacle course for keeping fit. But we come in and do all sorts of things here. We play with balls, we kick them, we throw them, we roll them, and we also run and jump around ourselves. So that was the hall and the gym hall. And now we're going to keep walking to the lunch hall. Good morning. Good morning. corridor takes you to all the primary one classrooms and you'll probably go and visit them at some point but the place you'll come to first will be the lunch hall. It's straight over here and then down a ramp past the toilets, past the entrance to the nursery and this is the lunch hall. You'll come in here, come along here Get your tree and then come and be served the food that you would like for your lunch. Once you've got your food on your tree, you'll come across and get a drink before you go to a table to eat your lunch. Well, you've seen a lot of the mainstream, but this is where you will be for the majority of the time, in the cove. Again, can't come in or out without a grown-up helping you. And we're back where you should recognise the coat heads, the 
quiet the snooze them and the soft play and then we're back at our red doors to go outside and go back home through the green gate thank you for visiting the cove with me there, we've only seen a little bit of it there's still a lot more to see but um, when you leave you'll come back to the green gate and go to your car and then you'll be able to go home and come back another day to see us let's have some fun together thank you